the library at the American University in Cairo is one of the oldest in Egypt that maintains a variety of rare books and special items. The full collections of the late historian Gabala Ali Gabala and Mustafa Amin, the founder of Akhbar al newspaper, are among the latest items in the rare books and special collections library. How do we decide whether it goes in the main library or our library? If it is something that is rare, it's particularly old, we don't have another copy, and especially if it's about Egypt or the region, this is our specialization, so naturally it would, would go to us. The majority of the collections are donated, and directly after receiving them, the preserving and the conserving procedures begin. The lab staff starts by cleaning the items, then they restore and protect the fragile pieces using different tools and techniques. There's a whole team working on this, starting from unpacking, uh, then cleaning up and, and dusting off. Uh, the uh, second phase is uh, trying to sort. We have a team of uh, researchers, uh, of staff, who sort according to the subject of the, of the book, the year and different criteria, uh, what goes where. After that, the items are catalogued to make them retrieval and available for researchers around the globe. What, what has increased is our reputation, that people realize we are a place that is going to preserve what we're given, that we're going to make the most of it, the best of it, uh, and that it is a, an excellent way of preserving the memory and the heritage of a family, of an individual, of whoever it was who collected that thing in the first place. Following the preserving and archiving procedures, the Rare Books Library usually organizes tours to let students and visitors know more about its precious items. I didn't even know we had, you know, we had such a variety of things in the AUC library. I'll definitely take advantage of it now that I know it. The main goal of the Rare Books and the Special Collections Library is to keep and protect unique materials for both existing and future generations. Tuka Omar, AUC TV, Cairo.